All right, so here in this video, I'm gonna show you how to wire up the trailer tail lights to your bug. So in the previous video, I showed you how to install the trailer hitch. That's solid, ready to go. Now it's time to install the wiring harness so that your trailer has functioning, functioning lights. Okay, so assuming you have bought a trailer wiring kit or your trailer's already wired and it has its lights, if not, you can buy them on Amazon. They're like 15 to 25 bucks, somewhere around there. Um, you will also need a tail light converter. So it's the number three to two, the number two tail light converter. The bugs run off three wires in the back. So three wires in a two wire converter. And you've got your uh, running light, brake light, and turn signal. It allows it to convert into one because on your trailer, the green wire is left turn signal and left brake at the same time and yellow is i'm sorry reverse that green is right turn signal and right brake yellow is left brake and left turn signal so that's hence the three wire into two wire adapter now the adapter um is <laughs> more expensive than the kit it was 25 bucks and i installed it right against the firewall okay so i got some lighting up here you can see how I installed the uh, the adapter on the firewall. I just screwed it in. And if I zoom in here, hopefully you can see right equals, I mean, green wire equals right turn signal. Um, red is stop, yellow is left, tail is brown, which is running lights, and white is ground. So now we're gonna hook those up. All right, so as you can see, the um, this bottom harness is the one that actually connects to the trailer. I routed that down along the firewall and, and uh, behind the engine, and it actually runs underneath uh, this orange panel. So it runs underneath, down through here. It comes out through here, and uh, there it is, right here. And I've got it just um, tucked away inside the bumper, and that's what's actually connecting to the trailer. That's wired, so, or routed. Now it's time to wire it up to your actual tail lights. Okay, so unfortunately the lighting isn't great, but I hope you can get the idea. So yours should, the stock setup should come up, should come with these uh, single terminal connectors. So I've got this uh, just dry fitted just so I can show you. So I'm gonna pop it off. I'm gonna pop that off like that. And you're gonna replace it with one of these guys. And these guys split your terminals. Um, as you can see, I've already wired the other ones up, um, so uh, you're going to need one for brake lights, uh, running lights, and one for your left turn signal. So the one I'm wiring up right now is, uh, this wire is white and black, so that's my left turn signal. So I'm going to go ahead and uh, install this side, press it in nice. And then, according to that little um, adapter, yellow is going to be left turn signal. So we'll plug that one in. And also plug in the original one, which is the uh, tail light, um, actual left turn signal for the tail light. So now, when we activate the left turn signal switch, that signal is going to come in on this side and split to both the tail light and the trailer light. Same thing with the brakes, right here, the red ones, and same thing for the running lights. So um, that's how you wire up this side. It does come with the green wire, which if you remember, uh, was for the right side. So I routed that up along here, and it actually goes up, so I'll show you from above. Alrighty, so you can see there how I routed it. I drilled a little hole um, right here in the deck lid. Well, it's not the deck lid, uh, the body. Put a little grommet and actually I'm running that wire up along this channel which sits behind your deck lid. There's the deck lid brackets straight across to the passenger side. Once at the passenger side I drilled another hole and dropped it down into the engine bay once again. So that green wire drops down I routed it along here ignored these other wires there for my light bar ran them along here um, and then once again I took a terminal splitter just like on the other side one goes to the 
um, what's it called? One goes to the right turn signal for the taillight, the other one goes to the right turn signal on the trailer. And that, folks, is how you wire your trailer. Okay, one thing I forgot to mention is the ground. The ground is this white wire right here. Now you should, let me get this out of the way. You should have a ground here, um, stock. That's where the taillights usually ground out. So I just put a little splitter down there and I'm gonna ground out the, um, this guy right here. That's the, um, that's for the, the trailer, trailer lights. So, so you can see right there, they're grounded.